Hey, my friend. <clears throat> How's it going? I just heard you rap. You are the biggest, best rapper I've ever heard. The words you spoke make me feel like I'm just another man. But sometimes things turn around in life and I go, Ooh, yeah. I'm thinking a little bit lower now. I'm thinking this with my heart. Otherwise, I'm looking above everybody and I'm thinking up here. I'm a monkey. We're all a bunch of monkeys scratching our heads. What's going on? Don't they understand what the song means? Love and sin? Throw him in a bin? Because he's just an old bean like someone he's never seen? He's never seen and he's never come? And he had to leave life the way he did? Because he left life the way it was. When Jesus came, and I don't really like to call him Christ, because everybody calls that a shit fucking word. But don't forget the word shit, okay, is to take a gun and you shoot it. It all depends where you're coming from. And the fuck? Well, if you're French, you know what a seal is. That's a fuck. So we're all fucked up. You know what I like to call him? When I see the Lord coming by, whichever way he's dressed, I don't care because I'm just a monkey anyways. But when the Lord comes by, I go, holy mac. Holy moly was Moses. Holy moly was Moses. And Christ is an energy. It's a holy mac. That's what it's all about. The Big Mac was here because the holiest of all Macs, okay, is Christ. But if we keep calling him, right, something nobody wants to hear anymore, because every time you talk about a Big Mac and McDonald's, <clears throat> you can get away saying, holy Mac, and nobody would know you're talking about Christ. We have to change the look on Christ. Just like I can go ahead and change my look any way I want. Ooh, holy Mac. Hey, he was a good guy. He gave it all up for us because he only came here to do that. The love, the love, the love. No one can understand the love because of the communication. And secondly, um, the one spirit that God loves, okay, is us. But we are falling towards deceit. In Indonesia, what they're doing right now is they drug everybody because there's an underworld that actually makes this whole world move. I don't even think where, where Earth is, because Earth is a, a place with dinosaurs. Didn't they do that? They took a plane all the way from where we are, all the way towards the Earth. I mean, because we really didn't see them come from the city. I mean, how did those? I mean, why all of a sudden would the dinosaurs come away because he made one dinosaur? That's not possible. He made more than one. He made so many. They were so big at the time. There were more than they ever said. They were all over the place. What were they doing there? They were running free in the fields. They could have all gotten away. Why did it just happen when they showed up? Because they're trying to show us that what we're doing, we're like old dinosaurs, okay? And we can break loose and come back into the world as these old dinosaurs. We can break the fence. The fence that was supposed to keep them in that scared us in the city, we want to break that fence. That's the brick wall on Wall Street. We need to send Wall Street okay all and over to uh where they call that in the middle the liberty tower send them out there send them to alcatraz what's happening is we're living in a double stim a double stim means uh we're we're uh paying another world we're paying the pagan world the pig this is because we're balanced in our minds the brain thinks you think the brain has to think of good and evil at the same time and you have to decipher what the right thing is it's giving you an option it's like tag if you ever play tag a game of tag well even online now you can play tag with the computer you say one or two words it says two words or three words or four words back for you and every time you write a word it's going to change what it actually says based on what you say so we're already playing the game of tag a deaf dumb and blind kid shark plays a mean pinball how, where do you think we are? We're a spermazoid. What happened to that spermazoid when he stopped growing, when he stopped moving? He moved out of the house. He left. He built the whole house. Look, here we are. He took what his mother, whatever went into the mother, he kept building. What, do you think that element is left? No. That's the element that's injected into us. Basically, I don't know how, through the air or what it is, is we already have the spermazoid, but it's dead. It's not alive. Okay, just like the reason we have prostate cancer. The spermazoid is not alive. It doesn't have an energy. But the minute you go for sex, okay, it's injected in all those spermazoids because they die. Don't forget, they die. They did say they die. They do die, okay? That's what they say about these spermazoids. They die because the element of spirit is no longer in them. 
And then if you don't show passionate love and you show love for money and your passion is not there, if you don't eliminate the spermazoid, it's going to kill you. The cigarette too is really weird. I'm not sure which way to go on that, but I, I got off subject. I always do. Okay. This is basically what everything is. Na, 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 I used to do it with this one here. I used to do it like this. Like this. You can do it this way. Sticking it. Look, I'm sticking my... You ever see the monkey stick his tongue out? Sticking the tongue out at you. Nee, 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 nee. Always scratching his ass. Man, the old monkey. I don't want to talk about George Bush's or Obama's or whatever, but war is, is just to create something else. What is happening right now, my friends, the dreads you wear on your hair remind me of the Titanic in which the boat was followed and something else happened and Rose didn't tell the true story. In fact, her name wasn't Rose at all. It couldn't have been Rose. Something was wrong in that name. That name was changed because usually back then in, in the type of place they're in, the names these girls say is only their last name because they're showing who they're owned by. If you're married, you're owned by somebody else. Okay? And if you're not married, you're still owned by somebody else. Isn't that the way it works up in that area? So the drags, okay, is because that boat was dragged. They threw something in the boat so it, so it had to crash. And I don't even know if there was a big iceberg or what was there at all. But the boat that picked them up arrived way too short. It should have taken a few more hours. I don't care what kind of boat it was. Something was wrong in the whole thing. They were just too prepared, too fast to go. And then you see only one guy taking names. One guy taking names. Then there were two guys. And there were three guys. But only one guy they really surfaced on. So what actually went down is when my friends and family came over on the boat, they didn't write anybody's name down well. And we were in the 30s already when most of them came down. 40s, 30s, 40s. 20s and they didn't know how to write anybody's name what's your name and they tell them a name and how do you spell it you didn't hear them say how do you spell it they just write it down so whatever you see is fictitious and your dreads are because the uh, the seals that are out in Newfoundland they had something to do with the crash of the Titanic that's why at the end Rose took her her gem and she just threw it over because she knew okay to be a pirate ship Hey, Scottish, hey, isn't that what's in the movie, The Old Pirate Ship? And the parrot is singing. It was a whole ordeal. There was a lot more that went on than anything else. This whole world is a lot more. Like I said, I don't even think where Earth, where, where Earth is. I think we're somewhere else. I think we're like inside Jupiter and everything is a reflection of everything else. Some sort. Anyways, whatever and regardless, uh, fantastic, man. That song was was uh, insanely good that's all I do my friend I did 700 videos and all I want to do is I, all I need is the power of love without the power of love I'm nothing I have everybody against me I'm not Jesus Christ and I don't want to be like Jesus Christ but I have this power and money pooey you can offer me a hundred million dollars tomorrow okay and I'll take it thank you Nothing else. Don't ask me to work for you or do something for you for the hundred million unless you're working for Christ. That's the only way I'll take the money. I'll take the money in Christ's honor to pay for some people, but you know what? It's all a hoax. I looked at maps. I looked at my Google. I looked at YouTube. Okay? And I see that there's a game in each one. In one of them, it'll go up to 60 at increments of 10. And then every time, <clears throat> and in the other, every time there's, wherever there's an element, a character of some sort, I can read into it. I can get a basic draw on it. This is a year I'm doing this, and I'm getting a lot stronger. But it's very hard to let your mind go when you know you're not safe. Okay, I would be safe if I had my family around me saying, hey, you're a little bit different, but we see what you're doing. Good luck. Here's a pat on the back. I need that. We need love in our life. In this world, if you don't have love, you're always going to be scared. Someone's looking over your shoulders. And it's just impossible to go. Everybody wants you to be the way they see it because you're not the same. You're different. Look at me. I don't look so bad. But I'm pushed out from every place I go. And it doesn't matter. The minute I walk into a place, they seem to notice right away. I don't know what it is. If you see something, tell me. Anyways, this is not only out to you. This is a general concept. I just wanted to show you one thing, if you didn't see it. You see these two here and these two here? Imagine a deck of cards. The four, the five, the six, the seven, the eight, the nine, and the ten all have these four corners. The one, two, and three card, the one is, goes in the center here. The two is here and here between these two, okay? 
and and the and the one is here, and the three is on a cross line on the car on the straight line, right down the center. It's right down the center because that's the Christ, Christ, right around the center. So this doesn't exist on one, two, three. So if you add up four, well, let's add up to ten. If you add up to ten, um, you take away six, you get thirty-nine. That's what the total count is, thirty-nine and. Uh, 49, sorry, it's 49. It's 39 and 49. I'll explain it. <clears throat> 39 is the three kings, okay? Also in the alphabet, it's the letter M. The king is the K, the M is the M, M, K, kosher foods. The M is the last letter in the alphabet before they start onto the second tier of creation, okay? The second tier in creation, the first letter is the R because it stands for A of the X-Man. A is first. R is second because it's the only consonant that has a vowel before it that's an A. There is no other one. There's the A, the first angel, and the last angel. So the last angel will be a system, system R. Look it up online. It's telling you all about it, but they didn't tell you it's in your own head. We are all destined for this. Okay? The whole thing is this is the book. This is only the cover. It, this is only the cover. It's all God. But it's inside the book what's happening right now. And we need to make it to the end of the book. Okay, because once you get to the end of the book, we know it's finished, we can close it and put it away. God comes. So now what I'm going to show you is this. You count the sides here, and you count the sides there, you get five, five, seven, seven, five, seven, seven, five. One, two, three, four, five, five passages in life. Number five, number fourteen, number twenty-three number 32 and number 41 and now you go zoop and now you get to the red one here and now once you're on the red one okay because you're always going up on both sides once you're on the red one you have one two three parts of creation because that's the age of 41 the opposite of 41 okay is 14 which is the letter n 14th letter one and four is five it's a passage 1441 and if you go look in Sesame Street right now one of their pictures they'll show you same street why well, I say Sesame Street I see see same street and it says 41 and uh, and uh, 14 and also the all these singers that die at the age of uh, 27 because it's it's a drug uh, related thing and it has nothing to do with the drugs they're actually taking but it has to do with how they're coerced into whatever whatever else is shoved into their food because just like they can change the spermazoid in us they can change the element inside of us to get sick and die because this world is all about rock and roll money 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 not about the songs it's only about the money there is no love love is communication when you get communication it's because you love you want to settle it out and it's not an argument it's understanding the other person how come you're doing all this? I don't understand. I don't understand. I don't understand. And then eventually the kid that says, you don't understand, he says to me, this happened tonight. He says, you know what? It's not that I don't understand. He says, dad, he says, he says, you're lost. You're in another country. And I said, son, I'm in the same country as you. I said, you have to understand. We are two individuals. We see things different. If you don't like certain things I say, I will not say them. You're going to stop me from saying them because you don't want to hear it? Then if you don't want to hear it, why am I going to say it? For no reason at all. I'll say it to the people who want to hear. Holy Mac, Jesus Christ. Every time you walk into Harvey's, right, or is it McDonald's, I'm sorry, Holy Mac. Every time you hear about a McDonald's, you're going to say Holy Mac. And who is that Holy Mac? Well, it's Jesus Christ. But when you don't mention its name, it's okay because after a while, everybody's going to say, Who is this Holy Mac? Who is this holy Mac with love and energy who only wants to give and it won't take any money for anything? I'd risk my life for anything right now, but I wouldn't risk it for stupidities. When I use that, I wouldn't be like the way um, it happened before to other people. I have to be very diplomatic about it. I'm not going to run into the streets and start saying, holy Mac. No one will move. They'll say, hey, you're in front of a truck. Holy Mac. I say, bah, I'm gone. You know? Uh, this has to happen online. This must happen online. We must find a central figure and collect everybody in the world. And what we're going to do is we're going to put out a little questionnaire and we're going to have to sit here and th shoot around the stuff to see what we really need to get done. Because you know, okay, they can't send the wolf over to everybody's house. 
So they send the army into the streets and they keep you in and they don't let you out at all. But you know what I would do? I'm the first one out of the house. And if they want to start shooting and shoot an innocent man, well, there you go. Now we know how it all started. Who shot first? I walk right out of that house right away. A little protection, okay? But I'm just walking out and all I want to do is bring with me a cup of soup and some water and juice, take my cat and go outside and sit in front of him and then move up two inches. Let's move up two inches every couple of hours until we fill the streets until they're surrounded and they have no choice. And then we'll bring out our guns. Everybody has a gun here. And want me to tell you what your gun is besides your mind and love? It's a power tool from Canadian Tire Home Depot. We'll start dismantling their trucks, their tanks, and everything else we see. We'll just dismantle everything if it comes to that. We'll take everything apart. We'll give them back the pieces. We'll tell them it didn't work for us. It didn't work for us. Don't need the pieces. I don't need no navy blue seal. We understand what love's all about, but it won't end there. If our power of love is not great, they will overpower us, and we will push them back. And then only the good will live for longer. Not only the good die young. It's not going to be that way. It's all the opposite now. The good will go high. The other ones will be swallowed up like they jumped into the ocean and a big whale jumped in and just gobbled them up, all the spermazoids at once. All the bad spermazoids in the world that got names like George of the Jungle Bush and Obarika Rabama or something like that. And Pope Benoit who has a hundred billion dollars and won't help the people. What am I doing here right now? I'm writing a book. I have to make aware of what I see and it's in my book. Sometimes I fool around because I fool around in my book. I'm writing a book. I'm allowed to fool around. If this was 100% serious, it's very serious what I say. What I'm just saying is we know who these people are. and They're all over and it's not just me saying it. But I'm trying to show you the sane way that the love to refuse the sex and to refuse the money, even if we need to leave, live, we have to back up. If we can back up enough so they, their demand of us is more, therefore we have a chance to move together. We know the love and trust is there, so now we have to really ration our food and everything and do the best we can. And once we get strong enough, there's going to be enough food everywhere because everybody's going to want to jump in. How did they get so strong? It's power of the mind. How you set up your church this is not a church, okay? This is what you call Hashem's house, okay? We will call this the house of the golden boy because that's what God calls us. He says we are the golden boys to him. He's a flash of light. He's silver star, and we're the golden boys. And it's been said over and over again. Why? Because that's the only thing that he can bend and fold that's gold and all at the end, you're still the sun, shining and gray, shiny like gold, just like the sun, just like father, like son, both golden and shiny, right? Pretty cool, eh? It's so crazy out there, man. But don't forget these presidents, men and everything. Not the Pope. I disregard completely the Pope from this. I take side with all the presidents, men. The only one I won't take side with is the Pope. But I will take side with the president's men because they're under heavy pressure. And eventually, once they saw the money, now they're laughing at it, right? Because they don't know the end result. So I understand them for the money at the beginning. But then, and now they become pigs because uh, the beta, the, uh, the machine, is now into a system where she has to trick man. Because man's supposed to learn. So she's tricked. All these smart presidents are now the brains of a five-year-old. Because you know what? You know how old Beta Machine was and is and always will be because it hasn't been changed? Beta Machine is five years old. Why do you think they came in? How, can you think like a five-year-old? Why is she five? Because she's A, B, C, D and in action on E. Exit and entry. E and E. Entry and exit. She is the machine. And everybody's being fooled in this entire world. It's love. Get to love, my friends, because we're coming into a big spin and God's going to choose how he's going to place the islands this time. God will choose how the islands will be placed and you will see the wrath come. It's coming. I saw the numbers. I, all my numbers that match, I look at both ends to see what's happening and sometimes it's out of sync. Like when, you, when the things move around, it's got to be colder than warmer. 
because the icebergs and everything can't break up because they're basically what solidify as to where we are right now. The strands are underneath and what happened is man provoked the iceberg to crack but God already knew that because Beta tricked them into it because she knew she was going to the other side of the world but everybody else thought it was for something else so funny anyways guy your stuff your oh man you're very good cool man